Hello, welcome to Three Orchid Drive in Port Jeff Station. Uh, this home is an eight room, four bed, two bath colonial with a garage and a full basement and uh, quite a bit more to talk about. Uh, my name is Bryn Elliott with Douglas Elliman Real Estate and uh, there at the property to give us this video tour is my associate Kyle Colliger. So I am going to put the camera on him. And uh, so there we go. Now we're looking at the front of the home. Uh, as you can see, it has a uh, young roof siding and windows. Uh, the roof was done a few years ago around 2016. We believe it was in 2016. And the siding and windows were just done in 2019. And uh, they come with a transferable lifetime warranty for that uh, new vinyl siding and, and windows. So let's uh, step on in. Uh, the home starts off with a welcoming entry foyer, uh, which is a real nice start there. Yeah. You have your coat closet. And then as you enter the home to your left is your formal dining room. And we'll get back to that a little later in the tour. And then to your right is your formal living room. Uh, they're all nice size rooms, good living space in this home. And uh, this home, uh, this, uh, this room has some built in shelving. Okay. All right, and then uh, towards the back of the house here is a real uh, cozy family room. Again, good space. You have crown molding in here. There's a wood burning fireplace. Real nice room uh, right off of the kitchen. It's nice to have your den off of the kitchen, that's for sure. The home's about 1,900 square feet. The town uh, assessor has it pegged at 1,902 square feet. As you can see, the kitchen has plenty of cabinet space. Uh, you have uh, uh, gas cooking. Okay, great. And then back here, we have our laundry and a full bathroom. And you'll see as we go through the home, there's plenty of storage in this home. There's some storage there, yep, okay. And then again, towards the front, we have our formal dining room. There's wood floors in here, chair rail molding. And that's your formal dining room, okay. Now, as we head upstairs, uh, we're gonna go see the, the four bedrooms and there's a, a, an updated bathroom upstairs. <clears throat> you have wood floors throughout the upstairs, which is terrific. Uh, nice landing up here, plenty of elbow room. Then our master bedroom has the wood floors flowing right through it and two big closets. Okay, again, all the windows have been updated uh, just, uh, just over a year ago in uh, 2019. And the taxes on the home, uh, the true taxes are $11,652.47. And then as long as you live there and, and put the paperwork in, you'll get your star rebate, your basic star rebate at the end of the year, if it's your primary residence for $1,119. And that brings you to a net after your star of 10,533 and 47 cents. So that second, uh, well, here's the bathroom. You know, you have, you have two vanities. It's a spacious bathroom, beautiful shower, nice tile work, uh, pretty floor. And uh, that other room we just saw that they're using as an office is the smallest bedroom. Um, and then as you can see, um, bedroom number three, and there's your closet wood floors in, in, in all four bedrooms, and bedroom number four. And the home's in Kamsawag School District. It was built in 1966 per records. Okay, we'll head back down. Home has a full basement. Uh, it has gas heat, gas hot water, gas cooking, a gas dryer, 200 amp service. And uh, the boiler is uh, a, a fairly new, uh, well McLean cast iron boiler, gas heat. The boiler was done in uh, right around, I believe in 2016. 
the property's not, it's a terrific lot. It's 0.39 acres. So it's just about 40% of an acre, you know, 0.39 acres. That's uh, it's kind of a swooping lot, plenty of space. There's a rear patio back here. Okay, you can see the new siding all around the home. So I, I really appreciate that the roof's new, the siding's new, the windows are new, the boiler's new. That's a lot of the meat and potatoes. When you buy a house, those are some of your heavy expenses. So if you want to update something, if you want to do some painting, if you want to update, you know, some fixtures or flooring, that's a, a lot, uh, a lot easier to do, a lot more affordable. And um, so that puts you in a good spot with this one. And, and that's your land all all the way there on the on the side there all the way up to the fence. A nice quiet block, uh, terrific colonial, plenty of space, just shy of two thousand square feet in Port Jefferson Station, Comsawag School District. Uh, it's it's a real good one, you know, two hundred amp gas heat, gas cooking, gas hot water, like we said, gas laundry dryer. So um, that pretty much covers it. Uh, there is a, uh, a, a, an attached garage. Above the garage is some attic storage. There's plenty of storage in the, in the house with the full basement and everything. The basement's unfinished in case anybody's wondering. And um, again, there at the property to give us this tour is my associate, Kyle Colliger. And uh, my name is Bryn Elliott with Douglas Elliman Real Estate. If you're working with an agent, uh, please, uh, you know, instead of contacting us directly, go through your agent. That's the, the right way to go about it. Uh, it's very straightforward for your agent to get an appointment to show you the property. They can look in our MLS at the broker section and they can see the, the straightforward instructions and, and get you an appointment to see it. If you're not working with an agent, we'd be happy to help you. We'd be uh, thrilled to show you this, this great home, uh, answer any questions you have, or, um, or on this home or anything else uh, to do with real estate. So um, thanks again for checking it out and um, have a great day. Take care.